Starting at the park class here for the, I guess we're gonna call this a cow mint hike. Highest point in the fault, except for Donorsburg. Feels a lot more wild though. Feels like we're very isolated. It's pretty cool. All right, let's go find the trail. Far. The trails are pretty well marked. Duh. And number three on the tree. Uh, the trail is impeccable. It's very nice. It's soft, minimal rocks. But there's a nice sets of fell along the side of the trail so far. But we're headed up to a specific area where there's supposed to be a lot of cool rocks. <laughs> Feels a little bit like some troll stuff. Yeah. And then I do believe you can see the, the vine straw stuff through there. I'm not exactly sure where that is, but it's really right on the edge of that valley that goes down to the middle of the industrial area. like you're exposed but it's fun with the rocks. We've been kind of on the rocks there for a while. It's definitely so much 
more industrial down there than it is in our area. Which means there's probably more interesting restaurants and food. Money. Let's go into the Zeke. One of the more dramatic stones I've seen. You stumble upon things in the forest. And sometimes you wonder what it means. This is why I love Okay, let's be real. I am thoroughly impressed with this trail. It is like the trails are impeccable. They're soft. They have like this nice coating of pine needles on them. And they're not muddy. You're almost always on the top. There's great views all over the place. Like they kind of peek out. And there's two hutas, so you can get refreshments along the way. And these twisty pine trees are kind of spooky and kind of cool. And they're very good. I forgot to mention that the trail markers are pretty good. It's not super easy, but it's pretty obvious where you should go. I mean, it's hella steep, so you can't just like go down through the hill. We also have not seen any deer, so I like that. And I uh, love um, They're not super dramatic, but they're pretty cool and very monstered. and I have to say this is one of the most enjoyable hikes in Raymond Falls that I've ever done. One day, you should do it too, but apparently not on the weekend because there's a lot of people. Today we met two other, no, three other hikers total. It is February and it is a Monday, so it's plain salt. All right, until next time.